1989. Dear Diary, I think I'm a good person. I believe there's good in everyone. But here we are, first day of senior year. I see these kids I've known all my life and wonder what happened. Three slots, burn up, bug eyes, closer, light ass. We were so tiny, happy and shiny, playing tag and getting changed. Three slots, loser, short bus. Singing and clapping, laughing and napping, baking cookies, eating paste. Full bag, stuck up, hunchback. Then we got bigger, that was the trigger, like the Huns invading Rome. is the Thunderdome. Hold your breath and count the days we're graduating soon. White trash! College will be paradise if I'm not dead by June. But I know, I know, life can be beautiful. I pray, I pray for a better way. If we change back then, we could change again. We can be beautiful. Just not today. Hey, are you okay? Get away, nerd. Three slots, triple, polo, polo, polo. Things will get better as soon as my ladder comes from Harvard, Duke, or Brown. Wake from this coma, take my diploma, then I can blow this town. Dream of ivy covered walls and smoky French cafes. Watch this. Fight the earth to strike a match and set this not the place. Oops. Ram Sweeney. Third year as linebacker and eighth year of smacking lunch trays and being a huge dick. What did you say to me, skank? Nothing. Martha Dunstock, my best friend since diapers. She's got a huge heart. Around here, that's not enough. Thanks. We on for movie night? Yeah. You're on Jiffy Pop detail. I rented the princess bra. No, again? Don't you have it memorized by now? What can I say? I'm a sucker for a happy ending. Martha Dump Truck. If you want to slim down, you need more protein in your diet. <laughs> Kurt Kelly, quarterback. He is the smartest guy on the football team, which is kind of like being the tallest dwarf. <laughs> <laughs> what is wrong with you? I'm sorry. Are you actually talking to me? My buddy Kurt just asked you a question. <laughs> what gives you the right to pick on my friend? I mean, look at you. You're a high school has been waiting to happen. A future gas station attendant. You got a zit right there. <laughs> Dear diary, why do they hate me? Why don't I fight back? Why do I act like such a creep? Why won't he date me? Why did I wear this? Why do I cry myself to me? Somebody help me, somebody fix me, somebody save me, send me a sign. They float above it all. I love Heather, Heather, Heather McNamara, head cheerleader. Her dad is loaded. He sells engagement rings. Heather Duke runs the yearbook. No discernible personality, but her mom did pay for implants. And Heather Chandler, the almighty. She is a mythic bitch. 
The Heathers are solid Teflon. Never bothered, never harassed. I would give anything to be like that. I'd like to be their boyfriend. That would be beautiful. If I sat at their table, guys would notice me. So beautiful. I'd like them to be nicer. That would be beautiful. I'd like to kidnap a Heather, photograph her naked in an abandoned warehouse, and leave her tied up for the rats. Shut up, Heather. Sorry, Heather. For a greasy little nobody, she does have good bone structure. And a symmetrical face. If I took a meat cleaver down the center of her skull, I'd have matching halves. That's very important. Of course she could stand to lose a few pounds. And you know, you know, you know, this could be beautiful. Mascara, maybe some lip gloss, and we're on our way. Get this girl some blush, and Heather, I need your brush. Let's make her beautiful. Let's make her beautiful. Let's make her bigger, beautiful. Okay? Okay! Out of my way, geek. I don't want trouble. You're gonna die at 3 p.m. Don't you dare touch me, get away, perverts. Why did I ever do to them? You can survive this. I can't escape this. I think I'm dying. Who's that with Heather? 